What's going on YouTube? Uh, it's been a minute. Uh, we've been really focused on our podcast here, the Fit, Healthy and Happy podcast. You can give that a listen down below. Make sure you're checking that out. Amazing content coming out every Monday and Thursday. Uh, but we're going to get back on our YouTube game. We're going to get back more to our roots and do some fun videos teaching you some tips and tricks. And today uh, we're going to actually cover an episode we did on the podcast, five tips to instantly look more jacked. And um, you know, this will sound gimmicky, but it's not at all. This works. It's incredible, there's five little things you can do to really make a difference, an instant difference in your physique. What's number one? Number one is get a tan. So these are things that you can instantly do without obviously getting more jacked and lifting weights every single day or just eating better. But getting a tan will definitely bring out all the cuts and the muscles that you've been working hard towards. When summer comes, you'll notice you'll look a lot bigger, a lot fuller, and that's not just because you've been working really hard, but also because the sun's coming down, you're looking more tan, and it's gonna look, make you look a lot more in shape. Exactly, if you have a tan, it's gonna fill in your cuts. So that's why like when you compete you actually get a full spray tan. We'll show some b-roll of that It's pretty hilarious doing that. I don't like like to necessarily go to that extreme But you know it's a good motivator to try to look your best go to the beach enjoy it show off some of the gains Have some fun with it And if it's a winter or you don't have access to the Sun and you don't want to damage your skin Check out a self tanner like the one I have on the screen This is the one I use a little bit in the winter when I find I'm looking super pasty and not my most cut up self You know sometimes I'll do that for some motivator for the gym lasts about like five days to a week So definitely something to check out Number two is you've got to make sure to wear appealing clothing. I can't tell you how many times a lot of people are in the gym just wearing like extra large hoodies and then just these like baggy sweatpants, but you'll always feel and look way better when you have something that hugs the sleeves a bit better, a tank top, something that just kind of really shows your physique that you've been work working hard towards. This is a great example. This shirt is super baggy and oversized and I do not look good. I instantly look way smaller. Number three is to get pumped up. Uh, we didn't do that yet, unfortunately, you know, normally we'd be going to the gym, but we said, kind of get back on the YouTube video. Uh, but when you're a natural lifter, you know, you're actually going to have a little bit thicker skin. Um, you know, not everything's going to be pressing out as hard. And that's why I really write up people constantly look pumped. They take their shirt off and you're like, what the heck? You know, but the difference between me just chilling here right now um, without a ton of blood kind of flowing through the muscles, pushing everything out is very different than me at the gym. You can see some videos of us pumped up at the gym. Even Kyle, you can see those veins coming out. Everything comes into form. So a great example to get a quick pump is just to utilize a red band, you know, do some curls. Um, even if you have a buddy with you, you get them to hold your towel. You're at the beach, you can do some curls, some push downs, do some push ups. You really want to focus on building up that chest, those shoulders and those arms. If you want a nice pump for the for the beach or wherever you're going or you want to look a little bigger, just a good motivation. And you know, we always joke, when we see people at the gym on Friday nights, we call them the pre-club pump crew. They're in there, you know, getting a pump so they look extra big before they go see the ladies. Yeah, and unfortunately this isn't gonna last too long, but definitely like Josh men, uh, mentioned, I really high, really highly recommend focusing on the shoulders, the biceps, and the triceps. And as a little bonus, we're gonna give you a free pre-club or beach pump up workout down in the description. Just make sure to smash that like button. This is 20 to 30 minutes of just exercising you to get pumped up before going out. Number four is to posture yourself up. Stand confident. You know, as silly as it sounds, even if I just have my shoulders forward, my arms down, I'm hunched over, I look shorter, I look less confident, I look less strong. When you stand up strong and you know you walk like you got something going on, it makes such a difference. I mean, I'm sure we all know that girl who's like five foot tall, but she walks like she owns the world and you're like, oh, I better get out of her way. She's gonna mess me up, right? So you can really exemplify your physique by just standing up strong, rolling those shoulders back, squeezing those abs. Muscles are made to contract and expand, so even your stomach, if you just sit normal, you can see my abs kind of protrude forward even though you can see the outline of the app. But when you're squeezing and standing confident, it's just such a difference, right? So really squeezing that stomach, and as silly as it sounds, is something I've been doing since grade seven. I remember I was a bit of tubby, so I, a tummy, so I learned to engage it, and I've actually had incredible abs ever since, and I credit a lot of that to actually being aware, squeezing and contracting them. Awareness when you're working muscle is everything, and the same goes just how you present yourself. Stand up strong, stand up confident, and get it. You'll always look more in shape and always engage those glutes. Squeeze the glutes when uh, you're standing still just to posture yourself a lot better. So chest up, abs engaged, glutes engaged, you're good to go. Then before giving you number five, which is an actual really cool trick that will make all the difference, is what we use for our competitors and it's gonna blow your mind. But we have a special going on, okay? So on our podcast we said, we wanna work with people that are motivated, that are hungry, that are not waiting till tomorrow. They're not tomorrow Timmy, they're not saying, oh, I'll start you know, tomorrow, next year, whatever. With that New Year's just around the corner, uh, we did a 90 day New Year transformation special where people could jump in at an incredible price and online coaching and get started towards becoming their best self. Now, obviously there's only about 60 days left. Um, so we'd love to take a few people over from YouTube, some of our really dedicated community who thinks they're doing okay, who thinks they're doing good. You know, 
other, you're doing all the things right, but you wanna go from good to great. You wanna have someone just nailing down your nutrition, your oversight, your training regimen to have the best possible program for you to uh, progress. So click the first link in the description down below, shoot us an email to take advantage of this offer. It's an incredible deal. You don't wanna miss out on this and we can Definitely. only take out a few people. So make sure you actually submit a really good inquiry. Um, but we're looking forward to working with some motivated individuals who are not tomorrow Timmy's who are ready to get it. What's number five? Number five, manipulate carbs, carbs as well as sodium. So a lot of times, especially if you have an event coming up, you're not gonna to wanna to just deprive yourself of carbs for the full week leading up. You're gonna to wanna to actually do a bit of a carb load. So this is something that, as Josh mentioned, we have a lot of competitors or even just you wanna look good for some special event, you wanna use carbs and sodium to your advantage. Add on to what he said, to utilize this in your own life, think of physique competitors. You know, a lot of people don't front load or back load, they eat super clean. Then they go up and uh, the, after the show, they have a cheat meal, they wake up the next day and they look better. So a lot of people get confused by this and this probably happens in your own life. You know, you deviate from your diet, you eat a ton of food, you wake up and there's a big disconnect from how you look and how you feel. You know, you're gonna wake up feeling like a whale, um, but you're gonna look in the mirror and you're gonna be like, wow, I look incredible. And that's because all that sodium, all those carbs, all that glycogen, is just pushing everything out and pumping you up. And a muscle is full of water, right? So if you can really saturate that muscle, it's gonna look its best, it's gonna look its most curved. So the way to manipulate this is you can simply maybe have 100 to 200% of your normal carbs, Cut your fats down a bit and up that sodium the day before a big event. Whether you're going to a beach, a pool party, you just want to look big, uh, you know, to meet up with your buddies or for a workout. Yeah. This is actually a cool way to kind of manipulate that and get this effect. Also, you know, if you're going to the gym before that pump, you could also try some uh, citrulline malate. That's correct, right? Yeah. Yeah, I always get confused by that name. But those are our five best tips. A lot of them are more short-term measures, but they will work and there's something to keep in the back of your head. If you want a long-term fix and you want to be your best self, if you want to go from good to great, Click that first link in the description down below for coaching. Sorry for the hiatus, so please smash like. We're gonna do more videos like this. Uh, we're just talking, dropping knowledge, having fun with it, going back to our roots. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.